This is Episode 7 of the series on Crazy Nuclear Rocket Engines, where we will explore the Fizzer. If you haven't watched the introductory video, please watch it now. The Fizzer is pretty simple. We start with a long tube like a solid rocket motor. There's a long rod of uranium-235 running down the middle of the rocket with a cadmium coating on the outside, just enough to keep it from going critical. On the outside of the rod is the lithium hydride propellant. To start the reaction, you drop off a section of the cadmium control sheath at the bottom, and that allows the bottom section of the uranium rod to start fissioning wildly. It heats up the lithium hydroxide so it turns to gas, and an exhaust of lithium, hydrogen, and uranium comes out the bottom of the rocket. The high neutron flux from the burning part continues the process going up the uranium rod. Here's a scorecard on the fizzer. On the plus side, there are no moving parts, and the design gives you plenty of thrust. On the negative side, it's excellent at dispersing fission byproducts across a large area. It cannot be throttled down or up. Do not hold in hand, light fuse, and get away. It gets a solid 10 on the craziness score. If you enjoyed this video, please play with a sparkler.